Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica the Dancing Avon Lady, and a while back, I had one of you guys ask me if our micellar water could actually take off eye makeup. So tonight, I thought I would demo. I am sleepy, so if I ramble, please forgive me. It is way past my bedtime. I'm actually waiting for a vid uh, video to finish rendering, so I figured I gotta take off my makeup. This is the perfect time to do it. So I'm gonna test out the two products right now. The lighting might be a little bit weird. Trying out a new thing. Not sure if it's actually working, but we're going to give it a try. Here we go. So here I have a very now bubbly <laughs> micellar water or Missler water. Um, I actually use this most of the time after I rinse my, wash my face, I'll use this. But they want to know if they could, I can remove eye makeup just with this particular product. This is our a new Hydrofusion one. Um, I've used this bottle for a couple of months now. It's, it's lasted me a long, long time. Like a little bit of this product actually goes a really long way. And then on the other eye, I'm going to be testing out our Moisture Effective Eye Makeup Remover Lotion, which has actually been rated one of the top 10 eye makeup remover lotions when I read it online a while ago, which means a couple years ago. All right, so I'm going to be squinty, I'm going to be blind, because now the eye glasses are off, off, off. All right, so first off, we are going to start off with our Hydrofusion, and I haven't done anything else to my face, I haven't washed anything off yet, as you can see, my face has a bunch of makeup on it. I fell asleep for a little bit, so there's a bit of smudging going on here. That looks so sexy. Rawr, rawr, rawr. Okay, so on my right eye, I'm just going to use the cotton pad with the Missler water. These cotton pads, they're not my favorite ones. I bought them because they were cheap. I went to Miniso and I saw a huge box of them of 800 for $2.99. I was like, oh my gosh, that's such a deal. However, they don't feel as soft as the ones that you could even get from like Walmart or Dollarama. Uh, and I always have to double up because I find them actually too thin. But I don't want to be wasteful, so I'm using it. All I'm going to do is, here's my makeup right now. And I am going to wipe off. See, with one wipe, you can already see that the eyeshadow is gone, and I used the uh, a cream eyeshadow today. It's the rose gold illuminating stick. I love this stuff. I have to do a video just on this stuff. Oh, the lighting sucks. I'm sorry, guys, but we're gonna keep going with this for now. So that's with one wipe. I got rid of my eye makeup, like the eyeshadow already. You can still see a bit of lighter, and then you gotta work a little bit more with the mascara. I'm not pulling or tugging, I'm literally just kind of swiping, like wiping upwards with the um, the cotton pad against my lashes. And look, at, look how much stuff I'm getting off. Ooh, yucky. Right, and under my eye. And so voila. It is... I would like to say pretty gone. What do you think? So this side still makeup, this side does not. It doesn't sting, mind you, I didn't get any of the product in my eye. Like I don't soak this pad so much that it's dripping. It literally, I just moisten it. So right eye is done. And as you can see, my lashes are now stick straight. So the left side, I am going to use the Moisture Effective Eye Makeup Remover Lotion. Which, my customers, I have people who buy these literally 10 to 15 balls at a time when they go on sale because they love it so much. So with this one, what I do is I put it on the pad and then I kind of distribute it by just kind of folding it and around. That way I don't get like one big glop on my eye. And here, they tell you to apply with fingertips or a dampened cotton ball. Use a gentle circular patting motion to soften the makeup. Remove with a damp cotton ball or tissue. Rinse thoroughly. Oh yeah, so this side I don't rinse. This side, with this I had have to rinse. The fact that I have to read the instruction on this proves and shows that I actually use the Missler water a lot more than I use this lotion. I'm gonna do it the way I normally do it when I remove it with the the lotion. So I go on here, pat 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 pat. pat you soften the makeup, and. So one wipe, you can see that the eye makeup, the um, eyeshadow is also gone. There's still, once again, a little bit of the eyeliner on here. There's still a little bit left. You can see there's still a little bit left on my eye, 
on my eyelashes. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that like brushing motion again. It's almost like a haunted movie. I'm telling you, I am sleepy, and when I'm sleepy, I have no filter. <laughs> it's bad. Okay, so this one was with the micellar water. This one was with the makeup remover lotion. I would say they're both pretty much gone. The skin on the lotion side actually does feel a little bit softer, more moisturized than the side on the Mistler with the Mistler water. I mean, they still both feel moisturized, just more so on my left eye than my right eye. There's no stinging on either side. Now, if you get a glob of this into your eye, yeah, that's gonna hurt. So make sure you do distribute it properly and use a very little amount so you don't get any products in your eyes. And if you do get products in your eyes, flush, 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 flush it out. So yeah, I mean, both of the products work fine. I typically use this because I'm, I'm lazy, especially at night, I'm so sleepy, that all I do is I just wanna wash my face get it done and over with, so I just stick with as little products as possible, and I'll use this. I love this stuff. Granted, like I said, this side does feel a lot, it actually does feel a lot more moisturizing than this side. Huh, interesting. I've never compared it like this before. And on both sides, both sides of the lashes, it does look like that the majority of the um, Mascara has been removed, which is the most important thing. You don't want to sleep with mascara on, although I have done it before because it does dry out your lashes and causes your lashes to be more brittle. There you go. So you guys be the judge of what you think. I find this one more moisturizing, which is definitely great, but I love the fact that the micellar water, it is an all-in-one. It does lightly moisturize, and I can do my entire face with this. So I can't do my entire face with this. So you guys be the judge, try both, and let me know in the comments below what you think. If you found this video useful, make sure you do give me a big fat thumbs up, and if you're new to my channel, make sure you do click that subscribe button so you never miss a video, and click that bell icon so that you never miss that video notification. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I am now going to finish washing my face, brush my teeth, and go to bed. Good night. Love you guys. Bye.